Hello guys, today we are at the hub of all of the financial districts of the world, Wall Street. And we are going to be going around asking people what they think about cryptocurrency regulations in the present day. Let's go. So before we jump into this, however, we're going to talk a little bit about what cryptocurrencies actually are. So uh, these are essentially just digital currencies on a whole nother market rather than just the stock market. All right, guys. So now we're going to jump into a little bit of the pros and cons aspect of cryptocurrency. So uh, to start off, uh, crypto markets are actually open ended markets. So anyone and everyone can actually invest in them, make money off of them and so on. Um, to add to this, there's a less likely rate to actually face identity theft because when you're using cards, there's so many different people holding on to those in a day, uh, such as the merchants at different shops. And when you're using cryptocurrencies, you don't have to face that at all. So now we're going to talk a little bit about the cons of cryptocurrency. So essentially, there is only one. It's a big safety issue involving it. There's a lot of safety aspects that a lot of people are kind of having trouble with. Um, and along with this, uh, Warren Buffett, he actually said that cryptocurrencies will never be a good investment. So we're going to see how people react to this and uh, we're going to see if they think it's a good investment or not, if they're going to kind of deny what uh, Buffett actually has to say. So let's go. Can uh, you define uh, cryptocurrencies for me? Uh, things like blockchain and uh, yeah, Bitcoin, things like that. That's yeah, all yeah, yeah. I know, really. So do you know that there's uh, a lot of people that are actually, um, like other countries that are getting regulated yeah. um, involving this? Um, the United States has, has luckily not be become regulated. Yeah. Uh, what's your opinion on this? Uh, I think it needs to be regulated because it's being used now for a lot of bigger transactions. It's being used in the real estate sector and other things that it will need to become regulated. So if, if the United States were to sometime in the future become regulated, your opinion would stay strongly that we should, in yeah, fact. Yeah, definitely, yeah, definitely. Do you have like any reasons to, as to why? I just think that, yeah, with large, large transactions going on, there needs to be some sort of regulation around it. Otherwise, it could be a bit of a wild west and we're going to end up losing a lot of money. Okay, since you know a little bit about uh, cryptocurrency already, what's your uh, opinion on it? I think it's actually a game changer. Uh, the blockchain is being will become ubiquitous, replacing currencies, and just the application of a distributed ledger in either healthcare or even as a currency. The concept is going to be adopted by multiple businesses, and quite frankly, is currently Ripple, Bitcoin, mm -hmm. uh, Ethereum, the ability to create your own exchanges. A lot of folks here on Wall Street are already doing that. Yeah. Um, so uh, since you know pretty much a lot about it already, you're probably uh, already knowledgeable about all the regulations against it in other countries, such yeah. like China, Thailand. China is almost going to be uh, banned. Uh, if the United States were to be uh, have a have a ban over it, what, what, what do you think? How, how do you think that would affect? I, I think it's going to be impossible to ban. Uh, here we're trying to work within a regulatory framework, um, especially something called Know Your Customer, mm -hmm. which typically is it removes the anonymity if you look at Coinbase. But by removing that, that's it's for tax implications. The, for here on Wall Street, we have Know Your Customer. When we create these private exchanges, we have to know who our customer is. Yeah. So that eliminates the the anonymity aspect. But from to remain anonymous. To answer your question, I think Chris, cryptocurrency is going to be impossible to regulate awesome. as a store of a store of value. Okay, awesome. Um, so we had a, we had another guy today, and uh, he believes it's a huge safety issue. Um, what do you, what do you what do you what's your input on this matter? A huge safety issue. There's uh, multiple layers of security, mm -hmm. um, not just encryption, but the from a mining standpoint, you look at proof of work versus proof of existence. Those two concepts as you move to blockchain 2.0, 2 you really have to prove your identity. There's multiple ways to do that. Um, that's probably the biggest challenge. Companies like Elemental and uh, Consensus, they're working on solutions to do exactly this. Uh, but that the security aspect, it's extraordinarily secure. I work with folks at Princeton University who, including the 
previous CIO for President Obama, they looked at cryptocurrency and have made several uh, indications that we should adopt it. But Jeff Bezos yeah. filed with the Federal Reserve yeah, to that. create a, 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 a cryptocurrency. Yeah. So it's ubiquitous, it's not going away, and it's, it's going to be a store of value for the foreseeable future, regardless of what it, how it manifests, either Bitcoin, Ethereum, or something else. All right, so after a few interviews, uh, we kind of found out that um, Bitcoin, cryptocurrencies, they're essentially here to stay. Um, that last guy we just talked to, he has an insane amount of credentials. We just looked them up. Um, and I mean, essentially, other countries are being regulated, but I think the United States is good to go. So you can take with this information what you will, and uh, you guys have a good day. Thank you